today's video is not going to be very, uh, I'm not going to be my usual self, cracking wise, making jokes, whatever, because I'm at uh, the location where Paul Walker crashed. Paul Walker, famous actor, Fast and Furious, but also from one of my favorite movies, Joyride. That's why I always love Paul Walker. But right behind me, right here, this is the business that he owned. It was called Always Evolving with his friend Roger, who was driving the Porsche that crashed. And this is where they were the day of when it all started. So as you can see, this is where the business was. It's closed now. I don't think there's anything even in there. And they're out of benefits. So there's a bunch of cars here. That they were showing to, I guess, kids and stuff. Not exactly sure, but it was like some sort of benefit. So kids and adults. But it was all in this parking lot here that they had all set up. And Paul Walker and his friend Roger decided to go for a ride around these streets up in Valencia, California. New all California, same thing. Anyways, this is where they started. So the Porsche was parked somewhere around here. So now I'm going to take you to the crash site, which is going to be very sad. You know, you don't know a celebrity, but it's always sad when somebody dies tragically. It doesn't matter if they're a celebrity or a regular person. And definitely not glorifying this. And it's very sad as a, hmm. yeah, so I'm going to make this a little more low key video. It's very windy up here. Hope you can hear me well, but I'll definitely just show you the route they took and where they eventually crashed. I've driven by it a few times before, never made a video, but I thought I would this time. It's right up here, right behind me, that road is where that it was where it happened. But I'm in the parking lot where it started. All right, let's go take a look. Going out of the driveway now and going to turn left. And if you watch the roads here, they're kind of built like a speedway. I can see how people can speed along these roads. It's like a racetrack. And just up here is where they crash. I believe they went around the around and around a few times. I'm not sure at which point they crashed, how many times they went around, but it's just up here. Where they crashed is right up here on the left and I'm gonna turn and we're gonna stop there. Right there. Here we go. Here's where the crash occurred, right here on the right. And looks like there's some stuff left as a memorial. Let's get out and take a look. Right. So I'm actually going to have to do a uh, voiceover for this part because it was really, really windy. Like, really windy. This is up in uh, Valencia, California. So it's about 30 minutes north of the valley of San Fernando Valley. And this is the pole that they hit. And you can see people leave things and there's rest in peace, Paul Walker. A lot of stuff is written about him there. And I'm just kind of walking around this site. And I'm looking and getting angry at all the uh, well, the markings on the road. Because it looks like people are still spinning out and having a lot of fun driving those roads pretty crazily. And it's just aggravating and kind of sad to see that, that people don't learn their lesson. And almost like they're doing it on purpose. I don't think those are left from the Paul Walker crash at all. Those are very fresh. But yeah, that's a new tree. Uh, sorry, a new pole. And the tree is gone. So it's a tree stump. The explosion happened right down there where, where it just was pointing. Look for that intersection right there. If you're ever looking to see uh, where the, where the uh, accident occurred. Yeah, so I'm pointing right now to where the uh, explosion was. And there is where the accident happened. And people were up there on the hill, they were taking pictures of the police and the fire trucks and of the bodies and stuff, which is absolutely awful and very sad and tragic for his family and both families. Come on, people should not be doing that. We saw a lot of the memorial in the days afterwards. These streets were packed. And um, it is kind of far to get to if you're in Los Angeles. It takes about an hour at least 
But yeah, it was packed with people, just packed for weeks afterwards. And now there's only a few things left out there, just a few different uh, little, like, some coins, beer. There's a Corona bottle, which I thought was kind of weird. But yeah, right behind me, that's where Paul Walker and his friend Roger way too fast in a Porsche. And it ended right there. I don't have anything to leave, really. I guess I could leave a quarter or a dime like everybody else, but what's the point of that? Just pay my respects quietly. So I wonder if all these skid marks, if any of them are left, I don't know. The crash, but there's a lot. I do know that this road, I'd heard about it before Paul Walker crashed. I knew that this road was used as drag racing and stuff like that, which I find absolutely ridiculous that people do it on public roads. And people have lost their lives, not just famous people. Don't speed. There's no point. Drive like a little old lady. Not to be sexist. Drive like a little old man. Drive like somebody that's... Well, drive... But also, they can be annoying to drive behind, too. Old people. Just drive safe. Obey the rules of the street. Don't speed. It's not worth it. There's nowhere you have to be that you can't be late for. A view coming... This coming car would be coming towards right here. Hit that pole and this tree stump. All right, off to the desert now. Let's see some other things. I hope this video was in good taste, not poor taste. If you found it in poor taste, I'm sorry, but there's lots of people around the world who want to come, who would like to come and see this, but they can't because it's California as far. But I'm showing what's up here. Why is that guy watching me? Oh well, because I'm cute. There's lots of people around the world that can't get to this location, so I thought I'll show it on my channel if they want to see it. There's lots of other videos probably explain it better, but Paul Walker, Joyride, one of my favorite movies of all time. Very sad ending right there. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's kind of sad to make. It was very sad. But I'm going to make happier videos. But occasionally I do focus on death and scandalous things that happen in California, Los Angeles, wherever else I am. So, this is one of them. Okay. Peace.